Hey all you beautiful sound recorders out there, today we're going to talk about something near and dear to my heart which is muting my volume when I need to on the fly. So a push to mute button and in voice meter banana it's, it's a little confusing on how to do it. So I'm just going to basically show you the setup and uh, hopefully it'll help make your life a little bit easier. So number one we're going to go to menu and we're going to go down to where it says macro buttons run on voice meter start. So we want to actually, I'm going to uncheck that just for the the purpose of the video and then I'm going to check it again and then we'll see the macro buttons pop up right here. These are your macro buttons. So we right click right there and pretty much this is how you have to have it set up. So push to mute, push to mute. Uh, right here button type it says two positions so this means that if I want to mute it I can tap the key to turn it to one state and then tap the key to turn it back. So for example uh uh, okay, so I, that was me just tapping a button. Oh, look, and I just renamed the button too. So uh, you'll notice that, just type that in it. We'll notice that even if I'm uh, typing in another application, it still applies. I just have the Y button set right now. Okay, uh, you set the button or the keypad or whatever over here. And then if you want it to be a uh, hold, you would put it to push button. This means it would last as long as you hold the button. Okay, so I like this one on and off and uh, request for the initial state. This is the initial state of the strip. So like hardware input one over here is strip zero actually. And then hardware input two and three, I think those are all like one, two, I'm not exactly sure. So, but basically you just write strip parenthesis zero parenthesis period mute equal one. And that's for when the button is pushed. So the mute turns to an on state when it's pushed. And when the button is pushed a second time, it puts it to a zero, and that's it. So then you would click OK, and click the button right here with your mouse. So you can click the button with the mouse, or you can use the key. All right, and that's it. That is how you set a push to mute button on Voice Meter Banana. Comment if you like, like if you do, and thanks for watching.